Welcome to School of Civil Engineering. As we have started a tutorial series about Estate Pro and uh, already I have uploaded almost 26 lecture and there I have tried to discuss about every part of a design sector and also the basic of Estate Pro. So from this lecture I am going to start a full building design and analysis. So I think it will be very helpful for you and if you are new here you can watch the previous video already I have uploaded so let's start here is our layout layout of foundation trains and column and grid beam here so this layout will follow so we're seeing that they have a one line two line and three line of beam in x direction and one line two line three four and five line of beam in y direction and they have a balcony they have also two balcony also they have a balcony so by using that we'll start our model so for that we have to go start pro first of all so from here we'll open our start pro and we'll open open a new project and from here we'll select a space and everything I have discussed many times in our previous video I think it is clear to you and also if you have any problem you have to see our previous video I'll give you a name suppose 5 5 story building this sorry analysis and from here I'll select our length unit is foot and our first unit is kilo pound then next from here we'll select add beam finish so only we'll take one point after that we'll click here uh, sorry here we'll click here snap noter beam and uh, I have changed that record properties I mean the toolbars according to my requirement so you can change that according to requirement and I have shown you our previous video that how to change that and the all link are given in description so click here we have found here here we have found a node according to our state pro so by using that node we'll draw our other nodes so first of all I'll draw nodes for X direction here this is the X direction and this is for Y direction we'll consider so this is our first note and this our last note will be uh, 3 feet 9, 9 inch away so we'll use calculator because we have to pro provide that value in feet so 9 divided by 12 it's 0 0.75 plus 9 sorry plus 3 so it will be 3.75 3.75 feet first of all so here click that node cursor and then select that then control plus C then control plus V and in X direction we have to give 3d.75 then press OK we found our next point this is our next point 
after that again we'll go here it's after uh, our next uh, distance uh, our next model uh, sorry node will be 13 feet 4 inch away from our second node so for 4 what will be 4 divided by 12 that means 1 divided by 3 is 0 0.333 13.0.333 so we'll select that node again control C control V here 13.3333 okay then press ok it's done again we select that and go here sorry go here for next point it's 15.9 that's mean 15.75 so press control C control V it's 15.75 press ok again we select that and go to our hair it's 14.5 14.6 that means 14.5 so here then control C again control V 14.5 feet ok again select that and uh, go to our model so here 17 feet so here 17 feet so we'll go here Control C, Control V, 17 feet. Again, we'll select that. Control C, and here it's five feet. Control C, Control V, it's five feet for balcony. So we have found our data required data in X direction. So now we have to go for y direction first of all we need that line after that we need that line and after that that line so for that line is the same as that line so it will be 10 feet 7 inch so convert 7 inch into feet divided by 12 is 0 0.58333 that means 10.58333 no then we'll select wall how to select that just click here left click and move your mouse like that and copy that then control C then control V it will be in Z direction it will be in minus Z direction okay because um, this is the Z direction and as we want to draw in that side so it will be minus Z direction so minus 10.58333 let's recheck 58333 10.58333 ok then press ok so these are next line and after that again we'll draw that line and we, we, we can draw this line by using the two point it's 12 feet 10 inch so we'll convert 10 inch 10 divided by 12 it's 0 0.8333 I mean 12.8333 so that 2 point from here that 2 point control C control V it will be minus 12.8333 let's 
let's check again yes 12 point from that point it's this that that line distance is center to center distance is 12.833 then press ok here is our the two line after that we'll draw that point from here I mean first four nodes and its distance will be we'll use our second line it's nine feet away so from here we'll go and we'll select that two node carefully that node and be careful that node then control C control V and go minus nine feet press ok here it's done and again we'll go here for that that one two three four last four nodes so we'll use that and it will be 10 feet twins away so for twins two divided by 12 it's 0 0.166 I mean 10 feet 10.166 feet away from our middle node and its last four node 1 2 3 4 so we'll select that two node press control that node again carefully that node Sorry, again I will check that what is the problem here. Sorry, when we have draw that two note, sorry, draw that note. The, uh, before that we have selected that two note and we have forget to um, deselect that uh, for that we, we didn't unselect that's why that two note also copy it so we'll use note cursor and that point and also that point and press delete then yes okay we have deleted that now it's okay now carefully will select that two control that two control that two so that on and um, in that four note will be distance away 10 feet to it it's 10 feet yeah 10 feet to inch. so for that it's 10.1666 like that so control C then again control V minus Z direction it will be 10.16666 like that again check yes 10.1666 then press ok so we have draw our node that required that are required for our this record as per our model so I think it's done and after that now we'll note or we'll join our beam like our layout so first of all from first point to last point we'll draw our beam and for second line we'll give her gap so by using that add beams so click on it then go here from that point to that point and from that point to that point from that point to that point again that point click here and here again click here again click here then again click here and again click here 
after that I can click here here I can click here and here again click here and here again sorry click beam cursor and click here and press delete yes because yes there there will no there will be no beam so I can click here add beam then click here and that point so from that point and that point sorry we have deleted control press control Z to come back so we have deleted a node also from here so we have to select from that point to that point that point to that point and that point to that point I have deleted that node that I have selected from here and that is wrong so I have come back by pressing ctrl Z so it's done now for that line we select that point to that point that point to that point that point to that point and for that line that point to that point that point to that point and that point to that point and again from that point to that point now I'll join that line from that point to that point that point to that point if I go again here here that line and there will be no beam because there will be balcony so that line that line that line that line that line every line we have to connect it so from carefully that point to that point after that that point to that point that point to that point from here to here from that point to that point that point to that point from that point to that point and that point to that point and here also will be balcony so here there will be two balconies so almost we have done oh sorry here to here here to here and here to here now it's same as our it's same as our model I mean it's same as our layout it's both the same so in our next video I will start from here and uh, if you follow my lecture you don't know y y you know about that I don't like to lengthy my video because personally I don't like that so thank you thank you very much still stay connected till next video